Aquarius. Why you keep them so delirious, baby? It is Mira, it is Shira, it is Vera, it is Scorpion Red Tarot, and I am back at it again. Back, back at it again. Yes, we are. To let you guys know what the energies are surrounding you for the month of September in love. I want to give a shout out to all my OGs. I want to give a shout out to all my newbies. I want to give a shout out to every last one of my babies for like, sharing, subscribing, and clicking this video. Um, you know, before we get into any energies, we always want to reach out and just give praise and thanks to God for just waking us up today and just blessing us with this, you know, anointed body, okay, of greatness and abundance. So, Father God, thank you so much for blessing the sign of Aquarius. Thank you for waking us up every day. Thank you for making us prepared and able and ready to tackle and uh, defeat any challenges you know <laughs> listen we were prepared and born to win so father god we just want to thank you for just making us so confident and just making us again stable ready and able please give the sign of aquarius the guidance that they need to receive to help nurture and grow their current relationships and to um call in successful loving and uh hmm Relationships with longevity and abundance um, into the future. So, Father God, we thank you so much for um, all of these wonderful energies that you have surrounding us. Please give us the guidance and the wisdom that we need to receive for the sign of Aquarius. In Jesus' name, amen, amen, and amen. All right, hold on. One second. Okay, cool. All right, so let's get into this Aquarius. Let's see what we got going on with you in love. Let's see what we got going on with my Aquarius is in love. Aquarius. Why you keep them so delirious? Why everybody be so upset with you all the time? <laughs> People always be talking shit about my Aquarius. I love me in Aquarius though. I'm a, I'm attracted to intelligence. So I love me in Aquarius. But you can always sit down and have some good conversation with an Aquarius. And they are the life of the fucking party. I love me in Aquarius. You don't got a good Aquarius in your life. Shame on you, baby. Shame on you. Oh, damn. Oh, you got waiting. All right. You waiting. Well, look at him reaching over trying to touch her butt and stuff. Like, oh, God. Yes, sir. What you waiting on, Aquarius? Who got you? Who got the Aquarius waiting? What? You know, Aquarius like to keep a couple of options on the low. So who, 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 who got the Aquarius of all people waiting? <laughs> Clarify this waiting. What's going on in September? In love for my Aquarius. Who got the Aquarius waiting? Why is this waiting card here? What's going on? And you know that's a, that's a Capricorn card right there. You you dating a Capricorn? Hmm? Hmm? Oh. Okay, you got the Hierophant. And you got the Death card. So someone is waiting... I don't know if this is the Aquarius or if this is the person dating the Aquarius. Someone is waiting for someone to end a marriage or a connection or some type of commitment that they're involved with so they can start something with you. I don't know. Is this giving a sneaky link? You got the Hierophant. The Hierophant likes to be in control and... The Hierophant likes to guide and mold and mentor people. So it's like, I need you to stop doing that first before you can get with me. I just heard that people feel that the Aquarius has people patiently waiting on them. It's like the Aquarius is the Hierophant. It's like, you're a teacher. Like, is the Aquarius a teacher? Are you a teacher? I just heard, stop teaching these other bitches all these things and focus on me. God damn. I need you to stop doing that. It's like, okay, this is what I'm getting. The Aquarius gets delight in the engagement that they have in a social group. It's like they are the leader. They really get a lot of self-gratification from the way that people like dote over them. It's like they are like the grandmaster or the wizard. It's like like almost like a church. 
Like, you know, like how everybody like worships the pastor as if he's God. He ain't God. He's just the messenger. You know what I'm saying? Like he's a human just like you. But it's like they have absolved this Aquarius almost to like God status and some type of social group. And it's these women that I want to say like fantasize about being with them. And so like they go extra hard with their practices and studies to appease and to make believe to this Aquarius. Like, I learned all of this from you. I got all of this from you. Look, why well, I'm about to say daddy. <laughs> I just said, I just heard, look, daddy, teach me too. Look, daddy, teach me too. Chill. Mm -mm. Material, and I just said daddy. Daddy, 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 daddy. Yep, they, look, they give him money at free will. Is this a fucking pimp? Is this a fucking pimp? Daddy, 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 daddy. Ooh, that's just my daddy. And you know that he's your daddy. And you know that he's be daddy. He is our big daddy. Daddy, 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 daddy. Tell me how to get the money. Come on, daddy, 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 daddy. I feel like somebody a motherfucking pimp by blood, not relation. Okay. I don't really Uh-huh, because these bitches give up this money. Free will. <laughs> I don't know if they paying a subscription, a membership fee, but baby, they be jumping head first, free will. And look, this nigga come up, he be like, bitch, break that pocket. Look, break, look. Soon, soon as he walk up, he tugging on bitch's purse. Where my money at? My money at? Okay? You want this ism, don't you? You want this ism, don't you, bitch? So, let me stop. Somebody said, oh, an Aquarius got to stop doing that if you fucking with me. Oh, that's just my daddy. You know he in the caddy. Daddy, 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 daddy. Go. <laughs> Yo. Yo. I just, y'all keep telling me I'm going to need him to stop teaching these other women shit. Okay. Won't you focus on me? Won't you focus on me? Okay, give me two more cards. You know that's just my daddy. He picked me up in the caddy. Daddy, daddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Y'all got me cut up. Please, leave, leave me. Leave me alone. You got the female energy creativity. And that came out in a reverse. I feel like y'all don't want nothing to do with these females, bruh. I ain't trying to create nothing with these bitches. I ain't trying to be a part of your little motherfucker whole covenant and shit, bitch. Fuck, I ain't selling no pussy for you, bitch. Fuck you think this is? Is this a real pimp, y'all? I mean, it is a higher friend up front. I mean, it's not in the reverse. I feel like he's teaching them good business and shit, but, uh. Yeah, he just said, these my babies. Ooh, mm, 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 Ooh, that's just my daddy. You know, he got a caddy. Titty, titty, titty. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I, when I split the deck, it says the one that you will fall in love with is not the one that you will expect to be with. Out. And then when I, the other it says still looking neighborhood peen or neighborhood puss. Let's see what we got going on, y'all. I feel like I don't this Aquarius or whoever it is dealing with this Aquarius, they want you to stop trying to be creative with these uh bitches, yeah. What is you what you need all these bitches for? Because they jumping out giving the money free will. Like what you, what you what you think I'm about to do with these bitches? I'm about to manage them. I'm about to mold them. Okay? I'm about to send these I'm about to send these hoes off. What the fuck you talking about? I'm sending these bitches. What the fuck you talking about? <laughs> Y'all, I swear, I'm about to do a street chronicle fucking reading. Cause I'm like, who be watching me, bro? <laughs> Where did this shit be coming from, you yeah? Have faith in this situation. Positive thoughts help. Oh. Oh. That 
loyalty is sexy as fuck. I mean, you still waiting. Yeah, and then you got it again. The one you will fall in love with will not be who you expect it to be. And you is waiting. You waiting and anticipating and shit, so... You waiting for this man to stop pimping. Or to stop his little social group or his little membership group where he mentoring these old and shit. I promise you, as long as these bitches is giving his money out free, but he ain't stopping shit. Fuck you talking about. <laughs> this nigga feel like this who he think God created him to be. <laughs> like these hoes need guidance. They out here bad. <laughs> like they, look, they doing it anyway. You understand what I'm saying? They need protection and they need guidance. Okay, and they need some structure. They need some structure. Okay, All right? Why well, get even when you can get ghosts? Well, uh, okay. Lord Jesus, what's going on? They they love home life with you. Hmm. So I don't know if like. Yo, <laughs> And then and then at the bottom of the deck. You got, you have people jealous and then a whole wanting to be a housewife. Y'all better cut it the fuck out. Y'all better cut it the fuck out. <laughs> so, I just heard just not with these bitches. Was you in the, was you in the group too? Y'all just said I'm waiting for him to choose me. Man, what the fuck going on over here, man? Because it's some wild ass shit over here. Because honestly, Aquarius... Boy, I, I kind of feel like there's someone dealing with this fucking Aquarius. I don't see this person changing his ways. Especially as, he, as long as these people are giving to them freely. This motherfucker ain't changing shit. And I feel like this person that you're waiting for... You don't want to create shit with them as long as there are these other people involved that are given to him freely. And that he feels like he has to nurture and guide and mold and console and all of this shit. And I'm sorry, I don't think that this person wants you in the way that you want to be involved with him. Like if you're trying to be a part of this group and... Bring your input into the structure, fine. But all of that other shit, like, you want him to wait and stop what he's doing and give up who he's molded himself to be. Um, he's indoctrinated into this. He, he would have to give up this lifestyle free will. And I cannot promise you that he is. I don't think that he is. You got the four of pentacles, you did right. You got the Six of Cups, the Two of Wands, and the Two of Cups. So, and then you got the Ace of Cups over here. So, I definitely feel like you're in love with this Hierophant character. You're in love with this person. But you're holding back because the love that you're giving with this Ace of Cups to this person... Yeah, you do let him in your house. Well, I feel like this is some square bitch that fell in love with some pimping or something like that. I really do. They love home time with you. A hoe trying to be a housewife. I don't know if you stop hoeing. If you stop tricking and trading and shit like that. Because you want to slow down and be a housewife. And you want... This motherfucker ain't ready to retire. He ain't ready to retire. He's not ready to retire. Just because you want to stop. And you don't want to live this lifestyle no more. He don't want to retire, baby. He fuck with you, though, because your loyalty is sexy as fuck. Because regardless, it's like you still staying down. You still waiting. It's like you not going nowhere. But I feel like you're just going to make yourself mad in the long run. Like. He is indoctrinated into this lifestyle. He is not changing for nothing and nobody. He love these women and they have a bond and things work well because they give to him at free will 
He not asking these bitches to do it. They are doing it because they want to. And that's why their connection is strong. Because he's not, they're not trying to make him not be himself. So he feels more of a connection to these women that are in this group that understand his standard of living and that operate by his rule. It's his motherfucker. He's the hierophant. He is the rules. He sets the tone. He runs the ship. Who the fuck are you to come over here and tell him that he need to stop mentoring these bitches and stop taking their money and stop. These bitches come at me in free will. Bitch, if you want to go, go. I don't know what you're waiting for. Like the loyalty sexy as fuck. But don't wait and don't wait in vain. Cause again, you got the four pinnacles. So you ain't giving this motherfucker your money no more. You like, I'm not, I'm not. I don't know if it was like two new girls that came along. And you just don't like it. You don't like these bitches. Cause again, like I said, they are fully immersed in his word. They're taking everything that he is saying at face value very seriously. And they are giving up this motherfucking money. Free will. And I want to say like these two bitches are best friends too. So it's like they're a tag team show. These bitches get bread. They get motherfucking bread. I ain't about to hold you. And I want to say like the connection that you have with him. I want to say like you might have been with him longer. You do got these people jealous. But uh I feel like he belongs with them, like not with you, because you you you're not part of the crew no more. And you're keeping your money to yourself. You're being stingy. You're like, I'm not getting like he got them them bitches money. What the fuck you need my money for? I'm giving you shit. I'm not giving you shit. You are not being a feminine that is associated with this anymore. You're not creating with them anymore. This person loved the home life with you and you loved it with them too. But I don't think you're getting any of it anymore. You got hoes over there trying to be housewives or you an ex-ho trying to be a housewife. And what God is trying to tell you, the one that you really going to fall in love with is not going to be this one that you done spent all this time with. You're holding back from this person for a reason. Because he keeping my money and he keeping their money. And it's like the, the love and the energy and everything that you're giving is not reciprocated. It's not. It's not. And again, like I said, this is somebody that you have dealt with. You have a very, very long, strenuous past in history with this person. And it's like these new bitches just come along and, you know, you focus more on them than you focus on me. And that's making me feel some type of fuck away. Like, you're not engaging with me in, on the same level. And, shit, the grass just might be greener on the other side. Like, why get even when you can get ghosts? Why get even when you can get ghosts? And the only reason why, the only reason why I, I stuck in and did and waited for so long and you feel like the loyalty is good as fuck is because I've been with you for so long. And it's hard to just walk away and let go of something that you've been doing and, and, and someone that you've been with all your life. Like, I want to say he taught you this lifestyle too. Like, he taught you this shit too. But I'm telling you right now, whoever this is dealing with this Aquarius, like, this waiting is in vain. Like, you better go and find your own man that you don't have to share. Because as long as these bitches giving it up free will, he going to continue taking it and to... You could be a hoe at home trying to act like you a housewife. And, like, you'll just have to wait for whenever he got time for you. Because, like, he got business. And he got business to run. Like, he don't got time for this foolishness. Like, and you already know. You already know. If don't nobody know, bitch, you know how shit going around here. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know what the fuck you waiting for. Like, Aquarius, if you waiting on Aquarius, whatever, please stop. Because he ain't stopping for you. And that's it. All right. So, um, thank you for sharing your street chronicles, cause that's exactly what the fuck that was. Okay, I reload it. Anyway, 
y'all um if y'all entertained by this because i was thoroughly entertained by this y'all hit the fucking like button cause it, look because i ain't got shit to do with me i don't know who life that is but bitch you need to write a book because that shit is hilarious anyway i love you y'all hit that like button <laughs> i see y'all next month peace